going on? This is Uncle Ron, aka Bully the Kid. Hopefully, y'all can hear me at a uh, loud enough volume. I do not have my stuff up to spec. Do not have any supporting cast at the moment. So we're just gonna run this thing just like we would normally run this thing. Uh, if anybody drops in here, they drop in. If not, this will be a short base hang, man. Uh, I don't have anything new to um, report to the board, per se. Uh, just um, maintaining. Nothing really new in the base sphere, like talking about. And uh, uh, yeah, so let's do this. And I can hear myself. Great. Okay. So hopefully I'm not too crazy loud or anything. Let me bring this down. So, but yeah, um, yeah. So I like to start off the base hang with the same question that I normally start off. If you watch, where are you watching this from? Go ahead and put that in the chat. Where are you watching this whole thing from? I think somebody popped in a little while ago. We'll say what's up to them in a minute. But uh, where are you watching this particular stream from? It's kind of where I want to start this whole thing. Um, let's see. Who we got? Who we got in here? We got BCC. Dino Dan, what's going on? Uh, oh, man. Yeah, you got Lee in here. What's going on? I didn't think you'd actually be dropping in here, Chica. What's happening? Uh, let me go ahead and throw this in the chat just in case you actually want to drop in and say what's up. If not, that's cool. But I will throw it in the chat for you. Um, always great to talk to you. So uh, if you want to drop in, cool. If not, it's cool too. Uh, we got Charles. What's happening? Uh, we have Justin. What's happening? Thank you. Appreciate that. BC watching for Planet Earth. I mean, that's that's I'm opening. So uh, north of Boston. Cool. Cypress, California. All right. Cincy. OK. All right. We have the resident special person in here uh, from my home. I mean. I guess you could be anywhere, but, you know, if that's where you want to be. That's completely cool, I guess. Um, Detroit. And then this is me. Let's see. Proper, what's happening? I uh, assume that you out and about, so you're going to be dropping in. Uh, now I'm going to go to bed. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, shout out to the homies. I'm assuming so. Uh, let's go ahead and bring in the, uh, homie waiting in the wings. He's been here for probably about three, four minutes and, uh, made a guest appearance on 100. So let's go ahead and bring him in. We got Travis. What's going on, man? Uh, how are things? Wonderful. Great, 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 great. Um, just, uh, letting everybody know who you were, what bases were you looking at at the time just to bring everybody up to speed uh just ordered an ehb 1505 sms there was one okay. with guitar center musicians friend that was open box mint so it was like mm. four hundred dollars off i called yep. the call in and talk to the folks they knocked like 200 more off uh i just got i don't know if i can show all of it i just got that move this back there. go ahead Okay, that is what's going on here. What are you doing? Ivan has BTB. Yeah, but what's what's happening in the front of it? Is there a story? Like, let me see it again. Is that was it? Oh, that's a ramp. Okay, that's the that's the body of it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I was looking at I was looking at the the. Uh, the middle part next to the neck, like it was a pickup. I was like, "Are you routing it out? What are you doing?" No. So, okay. Yes, but yeah. Cool. 
And cool, eventually, cool, cool. The, eventually the F-10 Fodero will show up someday. And then I keep dreaming of a Dingwall D-Rock, but that probably will never happen. I don't know, man. Once you get past it, I, I've had a base drop into the, I guess you call this a studio. Uh, and it costs more than any base that I've ever put on this channel that I didn't I didn't know that until after I was told how much he paid for this base. That video is gonna come out very soon because if you pay out 35 plus 3500 plus it better be real good. I would hope. And this base is just good. So that video is going to come out, play good, sounded great once I figured out what the heck was going on. But I'm trying to figure out what the heck was going on, it wasn't intuitive. And if I'm on a gig, I don't want to have to think about controls. I need to dial it and then move. Like, I'm not. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. My system don't touch them. Cool. Quirks are cool, but quirks that don't make sense are kind of dumb to me. Like, you know, I don't know. Like what Johnny was saying about the Sadowski with the knob that turns the opposite direction because that's the way the guy liked it, but okay. <laughs> We're gonna talk about it a little bit more. Oh well, uh yeah, <laughs> it's fun. Uh also have the Squire Rascal in the shop and it did not show up how you would like it to be. Let's just throw that out there. So there's that. Um let's see. Let's go ahead and check out where everybody else is. We have Niagara Falls, Canada. Okay. Let's see the new Stingray customizer, fretless five double humbucker. You, whatever, man. Whatever you, lady. You can do whatever you want to do. <laughs> you can do. Listen, you already have a VFR. You have like two classic Stingrays. You already, you already operating with all the freaking Infinity Stones, and you just keep on adding more to your gauntlet. And I don't understand why. <laughs> But you know, if this is if this is your lot in life, I get it. I can dig it. I can dig it completely. Let's see. Is that a beer fest mug? Well, he knows how to beer fest. No, it is not. This is actually from the rodeo. Uh I I worked doing ticket sales at the rodeo and stuff like that. So um uh, actually got this because I thought it was cool. Kids would get a kick out of it. No pun intended because this is a boot. Um, but at some point I probably will go across the pond and mess with Johnny and go visit everybody and all that good stuff. So uh, who knows? We'll see. You know, that is kind of a dream to just go over there and, 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 and cause havoc over there. Maybe drop in on Anderton's and teach him how to slap or something like that. Uh, let's see. Fretless sounds good with the Music Man pickup. Okay. Let's see. Did the reverse blend control get... Yes. Don't take away from my... Vi well, nobody watches these anyway, so I guess you're not doing nothing. But long story shorter, it... That and switches caught me... It caught me completely out the blue. I didn't know what to do with it, and I was literally learning it on the fly as I was recording it. So you're catching, you're going to catch my actual reactions to what the heck is happening. And keep in mind, I keep going right back to it. $3,800 after tax, bro. Absolutely. Absolutely not. You know how many sire bases that is? That is so many sire bases. That More is that's a lot of spenders. Actually, if you want to keep it real, that's at least three player series bases. 
I could buy three meteoros with that money. Three you go, of them. You go used, you could get almost five. But I'm, you know, I'm just trying to put it into, you know, if somebody's you. hopping on sweet on Sweetwater, or you hopping on AMS, or you hopping on Z Zounds. You know how many Sterling SUV bases that is? That's an entire lobster like mod setup, right? That's there. an army. It's an army of Sterling subs. It's an army. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Like you can do some damage. Like you could buy like let's see how much they normally cost. Buy 300. Don't play seven nation army, whatever. Uh so you give out like, five I of them and then buy oh so. it's one hmm. of the three. Nah man, that's you you gonna y'all gonna end up making that be banned in uh guitar center because that's yeah. I have to, yeah. Even play the bass either. Listen, we can only attack one problem at a time. Okay, so the two people there should be a bass. But I'm just saying. I hear what you're saying, but also it's called Guitar Center, not Bass Guitar Center. Bass Pro Shop don't cater us. We're just trying to find out where the hell we fit in. Really, I pulled up with my bass, the Bass Pro Shop, and they looked at me weird. They are. Try to give me a vision pole. I don't want a vision pole. I want an amp. Let me get that amp egg stack, baby. That's what I want. I want the one in the back, the dusty, dusty section. Let me get back there. there they go. have a dusty section, man. They tried to put me in a boat. I was like, I mean, I'll play bass on water, but also I need That's a generator. Bass on the- <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not smoke on the water. Bass on the water. Bass on the earth, <laughs> in the sky. Yeah, you know. Let's see. Let's see. Fretless does sound sweet, but is it? But it is pretty hard. I'm just a baby bass player. We're all bass players, man. I'm still a baby bass player. Let's see. I'd like to see the stingray you would make. I already made two of them. <laughs> okay. Oh, let me. I guess I can show you this. This is the stingray that. Lobster sent to me, and he and she was like, "Hey, I got this extra stingray that I didn't order. Do you want to do something with it?" And I was like, "Yeah, yeah, I'll I will definitely do something with it." So this is what she this is what she sent me, and this is this is this this would be my stingray situation. So this is an Aguilar AG AG four M pickup, very bright, very punchy. Sounds really good with brand new strings, like stupid modern with brand new strings. Uh, this is all also an All Dare preamp that I have in it. I swear by it. I love All Dare. I'm not sponsored by them. That's really my opinion. They're not paying me no money to say this. They are a great company. Uh, this is volume, high mid, low mid, treble bass. And then the plug is a nine volt system. And basically, I did the whole modification in probably 45 minutes because this preamp doesn't require soldering. So it was just screw terminals. In there, the only thing I had to do was uh, I ended up having to solder the leads to the battery compartment. That's the only thing I had to do. I had to just like cut them, cut them, solder, solder, done. So wrap. So it's a good time. It was so nice. I done it twice. This bass right here. This is the five string version of that bass. Literally, it was so nice that I ran it back. <laughs> so I was like, mm-hmm, I did a good job with the fourth string. I do enjoy a good five-string bass, though, so I ran it back. Same setup, odd dare, same thing. Does that five-string have the almost water drop-shaped pickup, or not pickup, the pick guard? Or is it just no, the No, it's the normal pick guard that comes on the sub bass. The only thing that I had to do is I had to uh, 
kind of open up the cavity to accept the different uh, pickup. Like it's a little bit big and I could have left it alone at the normal 16 and a half millimeter spacing, but I have a thing for larger spacing, especially because I slept. So I opted for an error. So learn from me. I opted for a 19 millimeter spacing bridge. And I should have got the 18 because the 18 would have been perfect. It would have been A1. But at this point, the only thing that makes it questionable is once you get past the 12th to the 15th fret, that's when the strings are kind of like close to the edge. So other than that, you don't even notice that foolishness at all. So um, it wasn't really no big deal. But knowing what I know now afterwards, I should have got the 18 millimeter and that would have been perfect for the setup that I had going. So um, I know, but I won't be doing it again. So maybe one day I'll swap the bridge out for 18 millimeter. Maybe one day I won't. I don't know. I might want to, you know, change all the hardware to gold or change all the hardware to black. And then I could just revamp the whole base, you know, but at the present moment, if you go with the gold, look at an anodized pit guard too. Keep that. Dude, so, so if I if I actually mess with it, I'm gonna go Avalon everything. Like I'm gonna take the dots out. I'm gonna have the neck redone with block inlays. I'm I'm gonna go full out. If I'm gonna do it, then I'm gonna do it. But at that point, I might as well just go ahead and buy Eleanor. You know, so. There's a high probability I'm just going to leave it alone. Just keep it completely how it is. And then also, Siren came out with these Z7s. So. Eventually. Come out. Yeah. If, yeah. If we. Yeah. On the same boat as the F10. Because I asked when I called about mine. The guy was like, do you want to order something else until that one shows up? I was like, eh, I could look at a Z7. Like in those five strings. I like that pink one. And he was like, let yeah. me look for you. And then he pulls it up and he goes, so those show the same delivery date as the F10. It's like, well, I yeah. don't two bases come on the same day. It may be one day after the other, you know, new bases. I mean, let's base keep it, let's, 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 let's keep it within reason now. We don't need to just, you know, let's just slow pace this thing. You know what I'm saying? Um, I do want that F10 or yeah, it is an F10, isn't it? Mm-hmm. F10, yeah. the F10 and the Z7. Those are the girls that I'm looking at. Uh, the messed up thing is the Z7 don't have the uh, black and metallic sparkly finish. I think that's only on the Z3. Mm -hmm. So that's oh. that's sad. Like I, but they did give me the pink one, and I, I do love being different. So I probably would grab the pink one. Just me being me. I like Gaudy. Um, of course, you'll have to swap that neck jazz out for another P. Then, then it'll be good. No, nah, man. You got to run that thing exactly how it is. Let me, let me get pissed at it first, and then we can do some swaps. But I have to buy two of them so I can make an accurate swap, just so I understand what the other side is like. Separate, but also equal, you know? That can be construed as a whole bunch of different stuff that we're not going to get into on this uh, podcast. Um, also, that's the first time I ever called this a podcast. And that kind of feels weird. Um, BCC, we just, to your question, my squire I have up for sale is the green, not the pink. Hold up. Let's go back. What we, what we got going? I just saw in the chat a block with my name that drew my attention. It was BCC okay. asking if oh, I yeah. had pink rascal for sale i mentioned it on 101 that i had one on consignment at a shop but mine's the green not the pink pull out the customizer all right we can do that uh so let's let me queue it up and then mm -hmm. let me uh go through this list real quick <laughs> what are you doing what customizer. are you doing it's a customizer no put that down Put that down. Oh, Jesus Christ. See, remember, remember what I told you before we got into this? You're doing the thing now. Just, just 
Take it easy. Don't. Yeah, you got a good thing in your hands. Just let it be for a little bit. <laughs> let it be. Let's see. Now, I kind of want to see Sono, Hondo, Travis, and the rest of the base game group go to Germany and compete in Beer Fest. Oh, you don't want me to do that. <laughs> I, I, oh, I don't. I don't want to try that. I don't think I'd do well. I don't. I don't. I can't. I, I'm already unruly. Like, the only thing that's holding me back is the fact that my mom would drop in at any given time. And she's really, really saved Christian woman, Southern Christian woman. And I can't I can't be a disgrace for the most part to my mom. So I have to keep dialing it back. You know, she just if, I go to Germany, if I go to Germany, it just, is all she just drops in while you're there. Dude, there is. Here's, oh, the only thing I'm listening to, you can understand this. This don't even have anything to do with each other. I'm listening to straight Romstein all the time. Do host. It's not a game. We're not playing. <laughs> it's it's yeah. Let's see. So you have a pink rascal? No. All right. I hate beer, but I love Europe. Okay, that's fair. Uh Watch the movie Beer Fest. Know it. Oh man, that's a sweet bass. Okay. All the engineering truly and doing God's work out here, man. <laughs> uh let's see. No one be drowning in Nevada beer on our trip. Listen, Leah. Let's not play that game. Let's not play that game. Cause all right. Moving on. I used to have one of those big boot. Mugs, you gotta watch it at the last couple swallows. Yeah, man, you gotta get the, the you seen the movie, you gotta get the turn right so it don't just splash everywhere. You gotta get that turn right, you gotta know what you're doing. Actually, my engineering mind thought about it a little bit. If you start drinking the beer from the side, you don't get that back splash vacuum thing happening. If you drink it from the side to begin with. Like that's that's fluid mechanics. Like if you drink it like this, there's gonna be an air pocket that's developed here. Okay. Once you get to a certain spot, it's gonna be like boom. And then the velocity of liquid going into your gullet is gonna be quicker than what you're prepared for. But if you start drinking at an angle like this with a boot either that way or that way, then it's a even distribution, 9.8 meters per second. That's what gravity does, at least depending upon the uh incline. <laughs> you, could, you could alleviate all the problems also mm -hmm. the viscosity of the liquid in question oh also the viscosity of the liquid in question because they do have foamy heads over there in germany they do depending on how fast you pour it you gotta let it sit there so that it goes down yeah that's the only time that too much head is a bad thing <laughs> he means with the beer, Mama Bully. No, no, don't address it. She could have been confused. Okay, okay, okay. Let's this move on. Steve Martin's the jerk. It's, yeah, yeah. Remember, he's working at the carnival, and his new friend's gonna offer him a job. Oh gosh. Okay. All right. I appreciate you, Trav, for being here, man. You. Yeah, you're you're you give me what I'll I get need. into the screen somewhere. <laughs> Let's see. Floof is here, but Floof isn't here, so I haven't brought him in. So y'all be prepared. I don't know. Oh, oh, you caught. Oh, wait, I'm, I'm here you're... vocal only as of right now. Uh, oh. Maggie is taking a nap. I, I am here. Okay, uh, well, Floof, so you know, no cam, but you know, I'm here. Hello. Oh. Okay, I'll let you for now. Okay, I'll let you sit around there. Let's throw you on the back burner, I guess. Perfect. <clears throat> Let's see. Yep, so I'm just talking quietly. So anyway, the Ernie Ball customizer is fun. Yes, that's what everybody's yeah, I'm gonna get into it. Uh let's see. Let's go ahead and just drop it in. You wanna see the last mod I did on my Harley Benton? Sure, let's go for it. 
So I got the, I told you I did the Geezer Butler EMG swap. My lighting okay. is terrible. I got Ooh, my. I got printer. that base. Okay, and go ahead. I got my 3D printer to work, so I printed the knobs rather than okay. paying yeah. 16 bucks to buy some, and 3D okay. thumb wrist. Okay, is that too high? What do you mean? Is that good for you? Okay. That's. I like to play right under the neck for some reason. Hey, hey, oh, that, okay. Uh, if that that thumb rest works for you, then that's awesome. I mean, yeah, I I, mm, I'm more of a bridge, more of a bridge player. Even when I got a P base, like my hands normally towards the bridge. That could just be me. Uh, my hand is uh, normally right behind the P base position, like right. Let's behind. see. Like right in front of the music man, right behind the P bass. Music man. Very strange, but it works. Oh shoot! Here we go. All right, so we're going. No, I don't want to sign up for your newsletter. Give me. Let's get into this. Y'all ready? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, window. Let's Yo, get in on this. Customization nation. Let's get in upon this. Leah, you asked for it. I'm I'm out here. Let's get it going. Uh, can you boost your volume about five dB? Yeah, I could do that. I'm kind of quiet right now. Did Bully just add physics so. to drinking? Yes. Yeah, I did. <laughs> yes, I did. The engineering to it. Uh, Matt, listen, here's the thing. As, fall off the floor. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. If you're going to do something, do it efficiently. If you're trying to get to a destination... Straight line, baby. You know? Okay? I got time to play around with it. <laughs> I got time to play with it. You know what exactly what it is when I pull up. Mm -hmm. I got a muscle shirt and a and a beanie on, bro. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what I'm doing half the time either, but I make YouTube videos, so, you know, I don't have to. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just go. I mean, you're just like me. Let's see. <laughs> Customized design experience. I'm just happy to be here. I'm just a dog chasing a car. I don't know what I actually do if I actually get one. That's very I'm chasing. Important, honestly. <laughs> so let's let's do a traditional bill. You ready? All right. How about we do this? How about all of us build a stingray for, and then we just share with the class when we're done. Ooh. You can do yours on strings that uh, streams. That way, people know what they're. Uh, doing. No, I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to but... influence what you got going. So let oh, me no, stop I know, screen. I know. Okay. All right, let's get it like well, Travis, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing? I'm showing off my cool shirt. You're so funny. <laughs> oh no, business right, just right, picked right. up. So I'm I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait right, till I get the uh, okay. Gonna... All right, all right, all right. Uh, We're doing the anyway. Build. How long? How long yep. do you want to do it? Do you want to do it for like a good minute or two? I nah, man, we, we're going. Go share my screen because I don't have like webcams and stuff so I'm using an iPad. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. We can work with that. Wait. Uh, if you're pulled in, you should be able to share. There should be tabs on the bottom that you can, like if you click it, you should be able to share what you're seeing and if you go to a different tab, you don't have that option? Um. Oh, hey. I can pull up chat. That's cool. <laughs> I just have... You never... I you just never touched the screen. You never touched the screen. <laughs> I'm, I'm using the uh, stream, whatever it is, stream. Streamyard. Thing. I'm using yeah. their. I'm using their app on the iPad. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. YouTube. So I don't. I've. I've. This is the only time I stream is with you guys. I don't know anything. I mean, I don't, listen. I'm not holding I you thought, responsible for anything. There were buttons, and one does the chat, and the other. I guess so like let's 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 do it like this. You go to your if you can do like a separate like split screen and you can go to Ernie Ball and build your stuff, then okay. screenshot it and send it to Instagram and then I'll present it. Cool? Okay. Let's do, do that. I can do that on my phone. There okay. you go. There okay. you go. There you go. You ain't got to move nowhere. Modern problems require modern solution. Hey. For real. We are here. All right, so I don't have lighting, so my laptop screen is on white, so I have light. Okay, listen, here's the thing I went to Timu and ordered me a light. That's all this is. Everything Timu, actually, this is Amazon. 
and then Timu, and these are from the old house, so they're like messed up. You don't need a lot. Mm-hmm. Like, I, yeah, I, right. this is supposed to be blue. Okay, this is supposed to be blue. One side is red. This is supposed to be blue. I press the button, and then it malfunctioned, and now it gave me this cool thing. So I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna rock with that, and then. I have the new ones that I ordered, but I haven't put them up because it's giving me the cool stuff. So I'm leaving it alone. You know, it ain't broke. Hondo about a professional diffuser and all. Nah, that. yeah, Hondo can have all that. Let me tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna need a white umbrella and a light bulb. I'm I'm gonna buy me six dollars worth of lights and put them up high, shine them down, let the chocolate work. That's all I got for you. That's all I got for you. <laughs> it's, that's yeah, man. I don't mm-mm. anyway. We're back to this build. Okay, let's get it going. Do I want to talk through this joint? Well, while you go ahead and a little uh little slapstick fight over there. I finished. Oh sh- shit. Okay. <laughs> Loof. Okay. Classic me. Yeah. Just autistic. Whatever, bro. Yes. <laughs> He's like, I'm focused on this goal. Let's uh, get I it have... done. I have been told from inside lobster sources to uh, say that you you're good you you've got a green light. I've got a green light to what? Green light to let the lobster in audio only. Oh yeah, let's get it. Audio yeah, only gang, audio only gang. gang. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> you want to check some I'm I'm here for that shit. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, Walker! I'm gonna be first. I'm gonna win. I'm just trying. What? No, you're not. Trying you're to... definitely not. <laughs> I'm just. Well, I guess if partner. you're if you're happy, then I guess you do win. But no, nah. man, <laughs> go ahead and get in the back. <laughs> oh, hold on. <laughs> Hold on, I'm cooking now. Let me go back to the body. Oh, there's not an option on a custom toilet seat. That is bad. What if right. I want to build a prong, though? All right, listen, here's the plan. We break into Music Man. <laughs> <laughs> That's the entire plan. <laughs> go past that. There we go. It's We're in there. Me. Yeah, hey, nobody's nobody's asked. Nobody's asked. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, I'm. Ooh, okay. So no, it I'm... must not like my phone because I literally loaded it twice, and the only option it's giving me is righty or lefty. Finish build. So I'll <laughs> do it on me. Yeah, you're getting a stingray. You'll be fine. <laughs> you don't need options. No options for you. What do you think this is? A custom build experience? Jeez. No. Just you get you get to pick a stingray. Do you want it right or left handed? And you can do the rest. <laughs> if you, you want, want it spicy, custom- you roll the dice. If you want it customized, you wait for lobster to get a bunch of them and then just yeah. follow the instructions on the video. Shh. 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 Quit telling the sauce. Not officially endorsed by Ernie Ball Music Man. But if they want to. <laughs> Let's see. Do I want that? I don't want that. BCC, oh, cool. never call me an ASMR channel ever again. You're banned. I have no <laughs> idea any of that, but you're banned. <laughs> I don't like it. I thought I would like it. Oh, no. Okay. Black. I should sing a song for 500 subscribers. Drop A? Funny. Drop A? Yeah. You ever do drop A tuning? With the boys? <laughs> <laughs> shut, shut up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you, you, you drop the A with the side of the tism and then you go out. It's great. Shut up, man. Get the hell out of here, man. <laughs> The hell, damn it, man! This ain't. I, I feel as though 
thought process, bully thought process. I feel as though I'm going to lose. And I don't like the feeling of impending loss. So I got to shake back. Hold on. Wait, are we going for a competition? I mean, <laughs> we were it's making... Competitive base building? He's, yeah. he's making it a competition. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> That's how I am as a person. I have to have a goal. I have to strive. Your goal is to build a base that will make you happy if you bought it. Because I have achieved my goal. I'm not here to compete. I'm here for the hang. I'm here for the the Stingray bases because I'm slowly converting to the Church of Ernie Ball Music Man Stingray. This is the way. I'm, lear I'm learning. This is I had a I tried a uh, a Sterling Ray Four with two humbuckers in it, and I have learned that two humbuckers is actually the way. Mm -hmm. My third eye is opening. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah. Yes. I was thinking. Yes. And victory is set up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, I can turn the base around. This thing is crazy. Oh yeah. It's, oh. it's like it's like CAD software controls. Dude. Okay, control I'm ready. Left right Whenever y'all want to go, I have God tier right here. Go ahead. I love it. Just I love everything about it. Ready. I love everything about this. Just go ahead and just throw them up, ladies, boys. Let's go. <laughs> We're just guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Yeah. Smoke them oh, if you got them. Smoke them if you got them. Ooh, Ooh. Okay, okay. I have three that I made here, um, but I'm not going to go first. I don't want to go first. Oh, gosh. One Ooh. of them I think I'm going to order like next oh. week. Or <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> so Jeez. Lobster wins in the competition because one of them's actually going to exist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lobster really got the, the lobster really won the competition here because she's just going to straight up buy it. <laughs> Didn't know I was such a good designer. I'll have to make this a reality. Well, I, Lobster really did. I have reasoning behind it. Skill issue. <laughs> reasoning because you need it. I was going to use it as like a like a gigging base because like I want a fretless and I do well on a fretless and I want a fretless five and the double humbucker stingrays are pretty great in a band setting. So yeah, right, here <laughs> we go, y'all. There we go. Get that guy. How dare you? Him. How dare you hop in here and snatch my thunder? I'm ready okay. to go. We're here. We're ready now. I am. I am ready to rock. Whenever you got me, y'all. Uh, y'all envisioning me? Yeah. Fantastic. Deeply. This Wait. is gonna be like. Take it easy. <laughs> Take it easy. Ooh! 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 A slow reveal. Okay, uh, okay. Uh, Respect. Uh, Respect. We got that vintage Perloid pick guard, tool humbuckers with the classic black covers. I like chrome hardware. I am not AMP, I promise. This just faded red, I think, just looks good. And then, of course, if it's going to be Ernie Ball Music Man, it's got to have that roasted maple. That, that's the Tiger just, Stripe like, is crazy. That, that's gotta be like that's a this is a requirement. If you don't do this, then like you know, fortune does not favor you because fortune favors the bold. <laughs> I want I want a I want a neck with so many stripes it could be mistaken for lobster. I might dog. put that on. I might want to. I might. That was a good joke. That was a good joke. I also might put that on the shirt. Fortune yep. favors the bold. <laughs> now, however, if uh, if you know. If I actually were to buy one of these, I would either go with this color or this cool cactus satin, which is much more my brand. Yeah, it is. And uh, I'm starting to lean towards the satin. I just it wish is. it were a gloss. That's pretty much it. That's your Stilo. Mm -hmm. Oh god. Okay. Because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gaudy like you, bully. I can't do the sparkle and get away with it. Oh that. man, listen, it's a, it's a lifestyle, baby. It, it All is. right. So, <laughs> did you send anything, Trav? I, I am trying. Yeah, this is probably what I'd go with if I were to buy it today. Just go ahead and hit finish build and remember that I don't have three grand. 
Uh, that's uh, three grand for a four string joint. Damn. Yeah, which is actually Great. pretty good considering the fact that you can customize everything and it's barely over a Stingray special. I mean, I, say I guess one that's that I fair. Built, it, this is thirty three forty nine. Yeah, mine's coming at thirty three ninety nine. So, oh well. What did you guys get the hard shell case? I got the mono case. No, nah, I, I didn't. I don't case. give a damn about no case. Standard, just put it in the these box. Super slinkies will just be lobsters. The only place with uh, foundations. Listen, if I had if I had thirty three to just throw down, mm-hmm. oh yeah. Now the messed up part is I kind of have this base. In like three different iterations, <laughs> so I don't know that it actually is. What the hell? What's going on here? What are you? Hey. hey, hey, are you done? Let me Cook. no get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Nope, nope. You've been rejected. I have a problem. Send it back to the kitchen. Okay, okay. I think I got. I think I cooked yeah, at the nice. end. Hello, dog. Hey, El Tigre. Oh, hey, doggy. Good times. Oh, I'm on the ground looking at his food bowl. Oh, did you want to? Did you want right. to look at what I had here? Yeah, man. Let's go. Ooh. Mm. Uh, don't now, if money were no that. object, and I were more like bully, and I didn't care how gaudy I was, I'd probably go with something like this. Especially with the ebony, I really like the look of ebony as an upright player. Hey, it's familiar. It's familiar hey. territory. Right. Okay, I respect it. I respect it. All right, Trav, did did you get I, to send it? I did. All right, where send where it. is it? I'm excited for what lob, lob Leo, Leo, oh, lobster. Well, lobster, that's oh, Leo. yeah. The, that's. The five- the comment that was just said of if I was gaudy, like oh, hard, tired. Wait, that's wait. interesting. That is interesting. I hey, listen, y'all can think what y'all want to think. I don't give a damn. Okay, well, no, I'm saying floops like if I was gaudy, like bully, and then all the changes that are being made are basically the one that I built. Oh, wait, really? Like, yes, wait, wow, wait, <laughs> that is actually exactly what I just built. <laughs> That's really funny. The humbucker, the black guard. I, I like that's the- actually that's actually really snazzy. I ain't gonna lie to you. Just a that's really snazzy. Shining out on a dark stage. Yeah, that's but that's. But you can't get gold frets, so that was sad. Like, yeah, but they're stainless. So, yeah, so you ain't got to worry about getting them redone. So they'll actually there's just that. Outlive you. <laughs> I had my uh, I had pinky plecked, uh, and oh my god, the pleck machine was not very happy about stainless steel frets. It did it, and it'll automatically slow down. But it was just like over every fret. It was it was not a not a happy noise. It's angry. I angry mean, it's stainless. it's stainless though. It also, is. this is this is this is pretty. It's pretty legit. I ain't gonna lie to you. This that's that's pretty that's pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie to you. If I was yeah. gonna if I was gonna get one of the Sire Z7, see that pink one. Uh, yeah, I'm between that one and I'm between uh that black and white, uh black and metal flight joint. Yeah, that's I'm, that I'm does it honest, for me. If there is if there's one Wait. company where I could buy a base stone cold as like like no questions asked. I I will right. I will get it done, and I can buy it completely blind off of like Sweetwater or something. It would probably be Ernie Paul. Like everything else, I'd want to try Fenders. I'd want to try because they're hit or miss. I wouldn't buy a Gibson. Uh, I wouldn't buy most Epiphones. Maybe an Embassy, but I, I would still want to try them. Even Sterling's, I would want to try. But like Ernie Ball Music Man, if I bought, a, I I could just buy a Stingray Special and feel pretty confident. It's weird. But like I've owned one Ernie Ball. Unfortunately it was a Caprice, but like it was it was one of the highest quality bases I've ever held. I guess it's that's fair. Alright, so uh Lob, you going or you want me to go? You going? Alright. Let's get it. Turn. So number oh, one we have here. 
Shredded Stingray 4, and for the color, we have the Jade Pearl That's with fire. the white pickup cover, the silver pole pieces, the chrome hardware, Ebony. Ebony board with the block inlays and the matching headstock, and of course, mm, maple. maple. Um, so that is number one. Okay. I am not going to order this one. I just like it. <laughs> I have enough Stingray fours. I have um... not yet. Oh. I have two specials. I have no. I have three BFR. specials. Um, BFR. Two, two BFRs. Well, two BFRs are specials. Um, so I have three specials, and then I have two classics. Um, and then old smoothie. Oh, so three classics? Oh, whatever. Who cares? What happened um, to the pink? What happened to Pinky? Pinky's a BFR. Oh, okay. Yeah. The, the, and then the fretless. And then I have a natural uh, Stingray special with a multi coil pickup because I'm a degenerate. Um, here's the Ooh. second one. <laughs> uh, a little fretless action. Vibes. What was that? Where I lay my hat vibes. I have no idea what that is. What? The Pino Paladino line? Where I lay my oh, hat yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Yes, I, I know. I know this. Yes, yes, the yes, song. Yes, but yes. the meow, 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 meow. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It sounded just yeah. like that, actually. It sounded like just like that. Just like that. Um, <laughs> so we did um, the magma pearl here. Uh -huh. um, and uh, gold everywhere. Um, and then... <laughs> this is the an Austin Powers. This is an Austin Powers. <laughs> yeah, and I think the torque goes really well with the uh, magma it does. pearl. It does. Yeah, it actually does. That yeah. goes crazy. And Liquid then, hot magma. And I can't see the price because the, the little streamy is on. Can I move this? Yes, I can. Oh, thirty-two ninety-nine. Okay. Jeez. And then less than twenty-eight thousand, somewhere in that range. <laughs> this is oh. one I think I'm going to order. We oh, we man. all like the the pinky purple bodies. Lob and I both got the black. So this is. Stingray 5 double humbucker with the. I have to move this again because it's blocking. Lavender up. sparkle. Lavender sparkle. Mm -hmm. um, black everything. Mm -hmm. And a online fretless board. And of course. And of course. Oh, got to have that. You got to have that. Got to have that. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And I think I'll use this for giggies. For giggies. Okay. Giggies. All right. Those little giggy All right. you get. Yeah. Uh, Stop sharing. I know. Yeah. I'm going to keep sharing because I want to look at it and you're going to look uh, at it. Man, get the hell out of here. here. Get it. Go away. <laughs> <laughs> Go away. Uh, like whatever. Let's oh, see. Uh, that would be one botch. Uh, he is hungry but he doesn't get fed for another hour so this is what he does for the next uh hour uh once a week <laughs> on live stream he happens to just be close enough to the microphone and yeah. because i push to the gain a little bit so i'm not just super quiet uh because i'm whispering because yeah. I, I, he's asleep I, behind me sense. uh you hear meow in full force isn't that right bocce yeah exactly <laughs> <laughs> oh man Okay, so this is mine. Ooh. Yeah. 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 This is. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> I also thoroughly dig Order this. Out two. Yeah, this. Yeah, so I have an Eleanor. It's a thing. Like this is a thing. Like this is the, this is my Moby Dick. This is the white whale. This is this is it. And I probably never white buy whale. it. It's white. <laughs> I'll never. <clears throat> I'll never attain said base, but I can I can dream about it. But like, yeah, this this. 
Did, did you hear? Did you hear what Cliff said? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did. <laughs> I just tried to move past it as quickly as possible. Uh, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> yeah, I've listened. You can't play the game with Floof. You gotta. <laughs> you can't. Like you can't. Like Travis. Travis is another person. Like he'll say something that's offhand, and I'm like, nope. Sure, not playing that. Nope, not going to respond to that. We just gonna move past it. It then depends on the demeanor. Travis and Floof can either both call it back. Night. No, 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 no. Did you see what I said? Now I got to address. <laughs> yes, I'm, I did. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I I don't quite understand if it's as bad as I thought it was. I was just being quite literal. <laughs> was was this just an autism moment? Is that what yes, happened here? Yes, it was. It's oh, fine. Wow, that's classic me. It's fine. I, f- it's I, I find what you, I, I find what you said very, very funny. But were you, were you, yeah, I, 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 I also it. is funny. But I have to keep on. I got to keep on trucking. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. You got it first. That was not pat. on my 2024 bingo card. Head pats from hey, lobster over. Camera. That was the free space. That's the free space, though. <laughs> That's not the free space. The free That's... space is January 1st. No, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. Because you didn't know this was going to be it. This is a special moment right now. <laughs> uh, you know what? <laughs> oh, hey, look, it's that uh, it's Jono oh, Sono. Hey, Soto. Jono Sono. Th- no, actually, hold on. Before you get started, let me do this. And then you could do your own god doggone intro. Here we go. Go for it, baby. You got it. Hi, my name is Sono Jono, and this is Bully's live stream. That that's all you gonna do? That is so out of character for Welcome you. Everybody, I'm disappointed. <laughs> I, I am I'm very much so here. disappointed. I'm actually pretty tired and worn out from my LA trip. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. hell yeah. I am I am so disappointed right <laughs> very, now. So I'm very worn out. You had the you had the where's, where's the Marcus? Where's the Marcus? I Where wish is I it? brought it with me. I'm waiting for that thing to go down just a little bit more. What? No, so no, no, you, no. You also got info on the Marcus Miller. You got a, you got an inside scoop of the Marcus. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. Take go ahead, take you don't you don't just have because to... you didn't buy it. I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> you Around. You have the inside track to all of it. I don't understand why you're trying to do this right now. <laughs> I'm trying to get yours. Whatever you done demoing it, I need to get that one. That's what I need. It's such a good base. I wasn't expecting that neck to be super thin. It's really you good. Know, you wanna know what I like about jazz base necks is when they're super thick. Like the Getty one is like is actually a pretty thick neck, like front yeah. to back. But like the nut width is pretty thin, and I actually really like it. <laughs> It's very comfortable. It's very cozy. So there's a oh, you did send him a Getty link. We did talk mm-hmm. about that, right? Yeah, we did. Uh, unboxing yeah. video came out today. Go ahead and go give that yes. a watch, everybody. Go to Floof Dash yep. the Bassist uh, on YouTube and then watch the video. Uh, but before you go, make sure to like and subscribe to Bully underscore the Kids channel because you know you're already here. You might as well. Mm. <laughs> And chances are, if they're here, they 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 know about this. Uh, yeah, but like yeah. you know, I'm it's assuming good to, it's good to just throw it out. You know, wasn't the Getty what you had at the beginning of the stream last week that Bully was trying to? I was about to. Say, I'm, I'm, I was about to go grab it. Hold on. Came out today, and I was like, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. <laughs> say it again. What? Would you say, Travis? Would you say? I was asking if the Getty was the one that Floof was playing on the live stream last week that you were trying to guess and were like, no, you can't see the fretboard. That would give. And then I saw Floof's video today. I was like, wait a minute. I yeah. <laughs> yeah. He yeah. Just, yeah. I know so, that face from somewhere. Yeah. So, so basically I backed him in, I backed him into a corner and he was like, no, I can't, I can't do that. I was like, do it. <laughs> well, let me see. Let me see this piece of the bass. And he was like, nope, can't do that either. Oh, that's a Getty Lee then. <laughs> it sounds so good. I'll oh, shut God. up. Go ahead. It's do your thing, Flo. Yeah, it is really good.
Like but it's coming through that like, ag. It's coming through the Aggie though, man. Nope. Like I, straight in. Dang. That's straight up. Straight. Dang. <laughs> Like, so look, I don't need it. At, at looking at the face. I don't need Found, it. I'm foundations good. though are making that base sing. I am a believer of the SIT foundations now. I'm oh, are you? Them, are you? Woken up. <laughs> are you? That's woken crazy. Up. How that works. <laughs> They've seen wow. the light. Full circle. Hmm. Like, I thought I say, so I have some changes that are going to be coming to the channel, and y'all are going to be the first person to, uh, first people to know about it. Oh, and uh, one more thing. I don't know if I talked about this last week, but uh, the, yeah. Okay. I think I did, but just in case I didn't. Did you fix it? It's yeah, gone. I reverted it. It's good now. Nice. It's just a stingray again. Nice. Yep. It's not just the stingray. This is the idiot base. Oh no, there's nothing here anymore. What? Oh, it's, just it's empty. Just a stingray. Why? There's no such thing as just a stingray. Well, <laughs> Every stingray is sacred. Wait. Well, no. 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 Wait. 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 Why? Why? Um. So. Uh. It was mostly just like. There, there were two really main backing reasons for this. Um, the first one was for Sam. When I played his show originally, it was just a normal Stingray. It was bone stock uh, sub four. Um, and for his memorial concert, I wanted to do it the exact same way as I did it the time that I did it the first time. Because um, we're going to be playing the same song that I played at his recital, which is uh, Fuzz Universe by Paul Gilbert. So for that, I reverted it alone. Uh, I also just didn't like the PMM thing anymore. It just didn't hit the same. And I was like, I am kind of like killing two birds with one stone when I didn't need to kill birds in the first place. So okay, it just kind of so felt let's, like, eh. Let's, so. let's, talk, let's, let's talk about it. Okay. So maybe maybe I can perhaps throw this in here to you to think about. Just chew on it a little bit. Okay. Sure. You have the P pickup. You have the Music Man pickup. Right. Yeah, no. So how about we make it a passive bass, and then we go volume, volume, tone. That's what I did. I just didn't like it as much as I thought I would. I did it twice. Oh, this, this, this makes me sad because you have a P pickup and a bass that's not being used. I don't. So what are the knobs doing? Well, the what are you... there? Nob, <sighs> nobs are just normal Stingray, dude. It's volume. It is volume. Uh, triple bass. It is. It is as it was when it left the factory. Minus the whole so the basically, you need to take that P pickup out, get a new pick guard, and then nope, P pickup's already out. Just need the new guard. What is what's in that space? It's just open. Just yeah, got it butt naked. I just yeah, I just don't have a. I just don't have a oh. new pick guard yet. I bought one. Oh, <laughs> oh no. You know. I okay. have that similarity because that's kind of something that I want to do with this one as well. Like as much as this is cool, I'm just going to get a new guard and just have this like covered and then just mm -hmm. stick with just two jazzes. It was a fun idea. I had my fun with it and then that's it. Move, uh, moving wanted, on more. Wanted... What now? Moving on. I got this back. Oh, nice. So the next acquisition is going to be a 112 cab. And I'm going to compare and contrast and then make my decision on what I want to record with. This does a thing. It does a thing well. But do I want that to color my sound? Yeah, it, uh, so it does I'll, a really, really good thing quite well right here uh, all the time for me. <laughs> yeah, I no, I completely get it. And I've been had this for a few years now. Yeah. Gave it to my brother to mess around with because I had my rumble. And uh, if that's going to be my gigging amp, I need something, you know, that could be my studio amp. And me doing this with a 112, I ain't going to stomp nobody out, you know. Mm -hmm. And I still get yeah. some nice, nice sound. Product. Yeah. You know? 
So I have always wanted to have an Aguilar 212 setup. Like, I've always wanted to have it for no reason, just to have it. And then uh, I'll start with 112 and then see how I feel about it. So this is 350. Uh, I ditched my tone hammer. Can't go wrong with the 112. Dang. (laughs) I hear you. I hear you. I got it. Like, I get it. But I got this tone hammer for basically $300. So I'm not getting rid of it. Oh, no. That's that's a deal. That might as well be free. That's really good. Yeah, that might as well be free. Shit. Yeah. I got it for 300 bucks. Uh, didn't have to trade nothing. They was like, hey, I really want this TC electronic rebel head. I was like, okay. The 250 one? He's like, yeah. Okay. Well, let me get you a tone hammer, and then I'll give you $300, and then we call it good. And they were like, yeah. So I was like, here? It was like, here. <laughs> I'm going to go. It was like, mm hmm. You know, I paid $219 for that head, right? <laughs> <laughs> so I made out with an extra $250, basically. Um, or probably close to a hundred, I guess, whatever. I basically paid for a pedal and got an actual head. So there's that. So that's going to be a thing. Once I get that 112 and I will get that 112 very soon. Um, because I have to run them against each other because yeah, has to happen. Also, same brother that brought me that amp back brought me a uh contender back to the channel and i may just make that one disgusting because i ain't got no i have no other reason not to so i might make this gross uh yo bully let food back is he back oh he dropped out i know he dropped out and then sono's gone too Sono said be right back. Sono did something different. I so I'm going to bring this back, and I think I might actually put Demarzios or maybe Aguilar's in these and then just uh, revamp this whole thing. I don't know. I, I like wouldn't do either. Because <laughs> yeah. well, Demarzio doesn't make Music Man pickups, and Aguilar's are 19 millimeter spacing on the pole pieces. Uh, and that has 16 and a half millimeter spacing. So that, that would work. So. Maybe. Maybe. To accommodate for the 19. Or Nord Strand. <laughs> could do Nord Strand. You could, you could do an already build. But EMG. Uh, yeah, well, I could, I could I've already done a whole. I've already yeah. done a whole bunch of EMG stuff. I want to do something I different. Know. <laughs> so, you, you, you could. You could do Aguilar. I just um, love what Lobster will just chime in and be like, "Okay, here's the entire technical specs of every mod you might do. Here's why this will work." You you could do an I don't know why I remember this shit, but not you. You couldn't do the DCB five M. They have a ceramic one, I think. Yeah, thing. They have a so somebody I actually want to work with. I actually want to work with. uh, God dang it! It's is it Bartolini? It's not Bart. It's not Bart. Rest in peace, Bill. I mean, he passed away like uh, like pretty recently. Yeah, Mm -hmm. late last year. September Something like that. Yeah, I mean, I, I haven't, I haven't checked on the company. I think they're still doing their thing. Yes. Um, which is good. Yes, I mean, good to see that that, that they're you know continuing because you know they're a great manufacturer. But you know, it really sucks that he didn't, he, he passed away because he was a visionary for sure. Yeah. Um, yeah, I like it's his all, pickups too, and the MTD stuff. Mm. Mm-hmm. It's always such a huge L when, like, the visionary behind a company, like, an actual good company dies, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, if, if Bobby Kotick from Bl- Activision Blizzard died, no one would bat an eye. <laughs> <laughs> like, I as well as other people would laugh because he's just a corporate suit who wanted a golden parachute out of a company. But, like, guys like Bartolini, like, actually had their hands in on, on the shit that they did. 
and it sucks to see people like that go. Well, here's the thing: you gotta have people that are like flu to understand the world and where they, how they see stuff. So, I, uh, yeah, I may not have said it that way, but you know, <laughs> we're here. Now. Anyway, uh, so, you could just wanted to chime in. You could do Aguilar. They have a DCBM series. Oh yeah, uh, they do have a DCBs. ceramic bar, so you wouldn't have to worry about the spacing then. Uh, but you can't do the uh, then you would need a three way switch because you can't do the coil splitting on the DCB because it's only a two wire. Uh, but I'm not really tripping on that either. You just get a different if toggle. I'm, if I'm wiring if I'm wiring it up for the toggle, I can select it to go wherever the heck I want it to go. Because it's only two wires. The pickup is just pre wired in, in parallel, like internally or whatever. Oh, oh no, it? the DCB is series. Uh, is it? I don't remember. Yeah, it is. But it's wire only two wire. wires for the DCB uh, music. Actually, I have one downstairs, a four string. I can check. No, I don't want to get upstairs. Yeah, it, looks go like the, it looks like the DCBs are only wired that way. That's tough. Well, oh, we'll see. Shot, anyway. We'll see what the heck happens. Uh, I have a gutter build. I also have the EMG build that I showed you about uh, um, that I still have to drill out and finish up, and then that'll be dialed in, and I can make a video on that. That's going to be great. Um, I'm kind of running out of kind of running out of people I want to mess with as far as pickups go, and preamps go because I have the things that I like and I don't necessarily like I want to do a loosen hand I want to do a dark glass but I don't have anything that I can mess with I think so when you were talking about your Aguilar head um, I moved over to Trick Fish mm -hmm. um, so I'm rocking the Trick Fish like mini 500 head and that's been working real good. It has like the 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 Mike Pope uh, like preamp circuit or whatever. He's the like Federa guy. Oh, I guess shit. it does. I don't know, but because uh, they're they're all in cahoots now. They're all together. Uh, Pope and uh, Trick Fish. Um, and they also make the in onboard preamps. They have the the the, the, the flex IPA. core and the IPA. So the flex core uh, from the Federas you can get. Um, and they customize it. You can do a full four band, three band uh, toggles for frequency uh, selection on your uh, mid mid controls and bass and treble. It's like there's a shitload of customization. Um, I have one in my Sire P10, and I'm going to put another one. I have it. I, I was looking through all like my pile of crap in my basement, and I'm like, oh, another Trickfish preamp, yay! So I'm going to put that one in my ding wall. I think. Um, Why are you messing up Dingwall? What? Well, what? I already did. That thing has a fucking Stingray preamp in it. <laughs> I'm crazy. Like, yeah, yes, you are, dude. Yes, yes, you are. It's a five thousand dollar base, and you just split it. It's not five thousand dollars. It's a combustion, it's like two. You know what's funny about the trick fish uh, what? stuff is, um, I was talking to Hondo, uh, in his Discord, and. I was talking about like my Aguilar stuff, and he was like, "One day you will probably swap to Trickfish." <laughs> yes, and it's it's I the pipeline, like, yeah. the amp pipeline, the amplifier pipeline. Really? Okay, let's look it up. Yeah. So you have the Bullhead Mini Five Hundred. Yeah, yeah, and um, so and I had my AccuGroove cab, which I've had for probably like fifteen plus years, and uh, for this gig on Friday. And during the sound check, everyone's playing individually, and I play my stuff, and like I hear my instrument fine. But I'm like, I don't think that's coming from my amp. And then in the full sound check, I'm like, it's definitely not coming from my amp. So my either the speaker cable was dead or my cab was dead. Um, and I'm like shit, so I had to play that whole gig with <laughs> just going through a shared monitor. I'm like, okay, that'll oh, no. work. Go for the best. And uh, I mean, I. I, I I killed it because I'm amazing, but um, <laughs> love that, love the confidence. Um, I'm like, huh, I should probably hop on the Trickfish bandwagon for cabs. I was gonna do that or the Ampeg Venture series because I like that new Ampeg series looks pretty nice and lightweight too. 
Yeah. Weight is my biggest factor. Is My two biggest factors for amps are, uh, is it lightweight so I can throw it around and not, like, throw out my back? Because, like, my family's just known for yeeting their back out at some time in their lives. Um, so I don't want to do that. don't want to fall in their footsteps. What kind I'm of, uh, small. what kind of cab, uh, do you usually rock? Uh, Aguilar no. SL112, dude. Oh, yeah, I'm I got, all about uh, the 112s as well. Yeah, I, I think 112s are the best. It. Especially if you swap between, uh, upright and electric, uh, in the same set. Like, it, it's so solid. That's really why I like the Aguilar stuff so much, is because, like... Why is it playing music? Stop playing music. Hold on. Oh, no. You... You say okay, okay. The Ampeg say I'm like I'm trying to bring up the uh, their one twelve. Um, but like I never, I've tried Ampeg through both. Uh, I've tried Mark Base through both. Mark Base is terrible for upright. <laughs> yeah, uh, I hate super, it. Like actually, super super not Mark Base. Um, yeah. Like I've, I've tried a like... bunch of amps uh, on electric mostly, and I just really like Aguilar, just the way they have their stuff set up. Um. So I guess the trick fish is that they're like cousins, but like trick fish is a little bit darker is what I've been told. So like, I don't know. I'd be willing to give it a shot. Yo, uh, Billy, let me share my uh, screen for a sec. Is it, is it yeah, going? Yeah, those are nice. I th- there we go. Yeah. Oof, and yeah. Uh, these, are, these just came out. Um... So I was gonna try maybe snag two of these because like one of them it's like twenty five pounds. That's lighter than my uh, Tri One Twelve, really? which is like thirty. Shit. Yeah. So <laughs> I mean, I've just never been huge on the Ampeg sound. Me neither. But like their newer stuff, like the Rocket series, doesn't have that relative nope. to like you it's know cool. the, the old B series and the uh, what was it the old uh, what was it what are the the what was the old like combos and stuff like the 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 oh the scrambler BAs. the ba the, the, no, the scrambler yeah, yeah, the, the scrambler, scrambler is, a dis- is like a disappointment yeah Dude, that is oh that thing is i hate yeah if I you like big DI. tones the bas are your your go tos but uh i mean like i like the rocket bases it's just like i don't like the like because the way i test amps is i leave everything at noon and then i go from there Same. um but i want to like sit. And just have it be played at noon through like a P bass to get the most basically flat sound to get like the full color of the amp. And I, 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 I work for Guitar Center, you so know, now you get to like mess around with everything. I get to so, mess around with Mark bases and Aguilar, or not Aguilar's, Mark bases and Ampegs and occasionally Fenders and occasionally uh, acoustic amps. Acoustic. I think mm-hmm. acoustic is like turbo mid. I don't even think they sound bad. I just hate their control schemes. It's yeah, um, there's way too many knobs. Yeah. Uh, Ampeg, like, makes really, really good stuff. It's just not what I would consider my sound, per se. Uh, same with the Fender Rumble stuff. Actually, really good. I just, I don't, I'm not huge on the sound of it. Um, Mark Bass, uh, bad. I really don't like Mark Bass. But they've they've come out with this new cab, like, combo cab line. Where instead of the bright orange speaker shoving through a like a grill and being really gaudy, it's like a pure black cab. When yeah, it's, it's like stealthy. that Marcus the Marcus Miller bull crap. Yeah, and it, that junk uh, sounds horrible too. Like I yeah, don't like that one it's either. Nothing. It's a two ten a two ten wedge cab. Yeah, no, and no, no, I don't. No. I'm not. I'm, talking, not, I'm not talking about that one. That thing's poopy doggo. But um, I want. There's like one um. I have to find it. I'm on their website right now, so it's um, it's the CMB uh cab line, black line is what yeah. it's called, um, and those didn't sound super duper Mark Basie. They sounded better. Uh, I probably still wouldn't buy one because it was like nine hundred dollars for a one twelve cab. That's like forty pounds, and I'm like, mm, no. Uh, <laughs> but like you know, it's it's I. Right. You know, I it's compared I. it to one of the combos of the Rumbles, and the Rumble, I would choose that over the Mark Base. This might be just my ignorance, but when you talked about like a f- as flat as possible, has anyone tried any of the positive grid stuff, like their big cab or that new multi P 
PA input system, they have the live because they're supposed to be pretty flat fonts because they're supposed to be able to do bass, guitar, keyboard, and all of it. Yeah, I tried, um, I haven't tried that. I've tried some GK stuff, which I could appreciate, but like I never was huge on. It's got a scoop thing, and if you're into that scoop thing, it's really good. If you're that's not probably why I look. Thing, that's probably why I looked at you like that. I wish you would say something yeah, negative right? about I'm GK. Waiting. I'm <laughs> waiting for that GK. I can't, man, I'm like, like I can't, I can't it. say something super <laughs> negative. I can only respect them because they have a they have a sound, and the players that leaned into that sound really yeah. owned it, and it sounds great. Yeah, like yeah. Flea and shit like that. Like that yeah. when they leaned uh, into it, it sounded fantastic. Uche, Norm Stockton. There's a lot of yep, cats yep. that do the so thing, many. but um, that's I'm getting this Aguilar cat. That's happening, but at the end, oh, final man. boss, final boss is probably gonna be four twelves with the RB one thousand one. Yes, Ooh, yeah, we're talking. That's the that's the final <laughs> boss. Four that's twelves. The, that's the final boss. Four like 12s, you, man. casual house shaker. No, yes. dude. No, I'm I'm keeping it downstairs because that's gonna be my. I took out my third row of my expedition, and this is what I come through to my home church, and I stomp Negroes out with. That's what I'm <laughs> gonna do. I'm gonna stomp you down because you think you're gonna outplay me. I got four twelves, and I'm running tough. Neo split 750, 700 to the Wolfers, 50 to the Tweeters, and I'm coming. You ain't gonna stop. <laughs> I'm nice. annoying, and I got my loud ass bass, the one I just showed you. <laughs> I'm a problem. That's just my personal, you know. Oh, 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 we posting. Oh, yeah. Oh, we posting. Okay. I'm oh, right. oh, I was just. Tell, tell them that person because they were asking me about the music I was playing. I get it. I get it. <laughs> I'm here for it. I'm here for it. And uh, you will live in infamy mm -hmm. on the channel. Mm -hmm. So if y'all want to check out Leah's new band, Low and Lobster's new new band that she rocking with, YouTube. Uh, Go to the old thing. Yeah, she gets down. I, I just looked in gear chat at that Stingray special and the Red Sparkle. Uh, dang, I, I like that a lot. I really like that a lot. <laughs> you know what's even uh, it. you know what tempts me similarly to that one is um, there is a limited edition Guitar Center BFR Stingray. Uh, hold on, let me, let me pull that up. BFR. Guitar Center BFR. Oh, so they did a limited BFR run like for twenty twenty two. Oh no! Someone bought the last new one. Red. Oh no! I was gonna. I oh, don't know. Now there's only a used one. Uh, um. Oh, oh so you have it at your disposal. You fine. just chose not to use it. So no. I'm a sock. <laughs> Here we go. Up. Here we go. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll share the I'll share the screen though. Yeah, it's just sold out now. Oh no! Yeah, my my life is ruined. Ruined. Oh, another no, right. another base that I have to wait to buy. Oh no! I, I don't I, know. I they're, 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 they only I made like eighty of them or whatever, or sixty oh, of them. Oh. Another stingray she has to wait to buy. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. I can't. I can't buy. Well, I, actually, they have a used one. Um, but that's used. You just, just got to buy another and like wait to buy the custom. Try to buy a immortal. <laughs> By a regular person. Ew. Don't you know who I am? My dad owns a dealership. No, that's not true at all. I just like saying that. It, 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 it's hilarious. So I'm, I'm, who I am, dude. Don't you know My who dad I am? Owns Microsoft. <laughs> you can actually just ban your account, dude. That's it. GG, it's over. GG. GG? It's over. GG, it's over. GG. It's Joe right. over, if you will. It's Jover. I don't know how we got here. Um, okay, let's uh, see. I guess it's it's Stingray time in the in the, in, in the house of yeah. the whole. Yeah. L listen, I don't really need one because I got the Big L, and that's every 
that's every music man I could ever want. Like that was that's up there with Eleanor. So uh I don't necessarily need Eleanor anymore because I got the big L. So I'm I'm good, quote unquote. However, the only bass that I'm looking for right now is a five string bass from offbeat guitars. I need that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And I'm not it's, purchasing it's another works. bass. I'm not purchasing another bass. I haven't purchased one in years, but I'm not looking at another base until I get this one about them. I need that. I need it. I need it. And I need it in purple. And I need it with aged hardware. I don't want this one to be gaudy. I need this one to be chill. This, did we just get intimate, Leah? What the hell is going on here? <laughs> I'm hanging out with the dog. What's, what's, I was trying to fix the phone to start what? playing Carol for a minute there. But... She just laying what? down with the guy, the homie. <laughs> Little homie, he doesn't care. <laughs> She's a very, very stylish pillow. Oh, easy, self warming. You had a real tiger. Let's see. You were talking well, earlier about digging through all the junk in your basement. Whenever I finally get the, I finally got the 3D printer work, and I was telling Bully earlier when I get the whole modular thing set up, I'm gonna need to send you at least the core. And like a few pit guards, and you can dig through your junk in your basement and try to build a few of them and see what you think. Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> this is what I need more stuff in my basement. Well, it's it's the one that I like. I said that the idea came based off of where you had the one that was the engineering company that the body was changeable. But oh this was yeah 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 that, oh yeah that was fun. <laughs> The one that the pit guard would hold all of the electronics so you can literally like my thought process was especially if it was like emg where you can just unplug the things quickly change out everything you can switch from p to j to music man doubles whatever and then change the body shape quickly too so one core you just set up your electronics and your body shapes and, but when i I'm, I'm testing for size right now because it's hard and then I'll have to send like a neck with it, I guess, because you might need one of those. But you might have spares. I don't know. I don't know what all you have in your junk. Very well could. She very well could. You just don't you know, like. She has a drawer of okay. electronics that she. A drawer. <laughs> like a drawer, <laughs> drawer of electronics. <laughs> There's just. But I saw someone. You can you can take this and just whatever you want to think that's in there. But she has a drawer of just preamps and the like and, and pickups. And she she sent me some stuff like years ago that I've yet to actually implement into a base because I don't necessarily like, okay, remember we was going to do the embassy bill? Embassy and I was going to do the Gretsch bill? Mm-hmm. Like that EMG setup is up there. Right? Like it's up there right now and i just never did it so now i might try to find me a rascal or i might give me an embassy and just you should get a it out or an embassy embassies are cool as shit specifically i've tried a couple of them i think they're awesome for i just like, gotta figure out how it's gonna be laid out i just gotta figure out how it's gonna be laid out and make sure i don't have to do too much modification with the dremel and stuff like that that's the only problem yeah so with the yeah the the embassy pickups are a bit smaller like yep five percent smaller than a regular thunderbird pickup so yeah nothing thunderbird they're five percent smaller than thunderbird Mm -hmm. do the pole pieces line up though well man what 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 what, what do you mean like because i have a i have a thunderbird god yeah, and I, I I did the same thing because remember we were gonna do the Thunderbirdy build buildy offy, and I was gonna do the embassy, and then the EMG pickups were too big, and I'm like, I don't want to fucking dremel this or like do it. <laughs> so I'm gonna fuck it up. Um, <laughs> so then I didn't, and I, yeah, I my, think I I definitely sold that because I don't have that anymore. But yeah, my the my thunder my Thunderbirds downstairs in the in the closet with Mulaney rig. Like, it's just down there. So, 
Ooh, I can actually use the lightning rig to possibly buy. Did you see the newer release on the Thunderbirds where they have the brighter colors and oh, yeah. the almost no. like magic yeah. bridge rather than the horrible three pin bridge? Where? What? When? Who? Who did this? Ep uh, Gibson or Epiphone? Epiphone. I don't. I don't. I don't want any of this. Did you like that? You can up. you can have the whole thing. I don't want. Because I've always wanted to do like the phone Thunderbird. All like... right. What do you got? I think it's under their like sixties retro. Yeah, they brought out purple and blue. I um, I pre-ordered the blue because I want to try them out. I saw the red one and I was like, that looks really cool. And then I saw that it had the like almost a two pneumatic bridge. And I was like, oh, yep. I have to immediately buy a new bridge. This is mm -hmm. great. But then this it's also, not, they're also not great. $50. So it's also, it's, it is a, it's decent. still Thunder, it's still Thunderbird. Let's, let's just, oh, it's still going to neck dive. I mean, oh, of, of course. course. We're not gonna. We're not gonna do this. We're not gonna yeah, entertain. We ain't gonna address this. This is mm -hmm. this is one of the reasons I bought the three D printer because I heard your guys' story about the SG fun at Summer. Hey, and hey, I, I don't know where you're going with this. Hold on, I don't know where you're going with this, but if it has anything to do with the session cup, no. Uh, <laughs> the my my thought process was almost like. Uh, banded exoskeleton because the thunderbirds have the thicker portion in the middle with the thinner wing, where you take okay. it from the top side it goes against the thicker portion and at both um strap buttons it would have where it would attach in with both but then you would basically add a horn to the top to extend the strap button out to pass the 12th fret so that you would have the better balance Yeah, the, the extender thing. Sorry, I'm like, I'm super yeah. tired. And I'm like, and it's like trying to process that. Hold on. So you have a you have a you have a T bird, right? So we know the shape of the T bird. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the problem is, it comes in like black out, and it comes out heavy, and then comes down, and then goes out. Right. That's the problem because it does this. Right. All right. Mm -hmm. Cool. You talking about adding something on to the strap lock? To make the horn go out farther. So the, so the thought process: you have the body, and you have the strap button at the bottom. <laughs> top. You take the strap buttons out. I, again, I'm trying to design it through one of the 3D softwares, but it would slide on the thinner portion of the wing, rest against the thicker center body ridge. You would put your strap button screws back in to hold it in place, but then. If you think like the extra long horn on the EHB, it would be similar in shape to that coming off the Thunderbird. So you would be extending the mounting point for the strap, which would right. then create less of the leverage to counteract the neck dive. You extend the horn so that it comes out to about the 12th fret, like a normal, so, properly designed base. Yeah, I know what you mean, because I've seen those, um, I've seen what? those in Steinberger yeah. builds. Like I, I got I don't the idea. Say that on my channel. <laughs> no, say that on my saying channel. It's so true. It's like it's literally a Steinberger uh, bass strap hook. Yeah. It's well, like I had thought, I had thought of it one day when I was looking, like trying to figure out with the Thunderbird. I had like, okay, what do people normally do to counteract neck dive beyond get rid of it and get a bass that designed well? And <laughs> I've seen some guy who had replaced it with like a nine millimeter thick steel bar that just went into it and i guess he epoxied it into the base but it was just like a 10 inch long nine millimeter steel bar with the strap button on the end of it and i was like that looks like a straw that you just stuck into it you might at least make it aesthetic and then i thought hey you could 3d print something like that and use the existing strap button screw holes so you're not actually going to change anything you're not going to damage it you're not going to put extra screws into it I'm waiting to see how well I can get the design to work and then try it out. 
Good luck to you. Yeah. Don't so I, I'm not about to put this I'm foolishness up, bro. On it. Hey, <laughs> take it easy. No, nah, man. I'm not about to put I'm not about to do this, man. <laughs> what? Like is I see it, you, I, I see you dying. Do it. No, it, it's not even that. It's just he's he's on some he's on some bull right now. And I don't he's like always it. on some bullshit. It's Sono. That's what he's about. Yeah, look at that's that. What, that's why, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's how you eliminate Nick Dive, right? No, that's called a sin. <laughs> that's, that's See what I'm saying? See, but when I say no, when I say no, then y'all look at me like I'm the evil person. Nah, man. Listen, it, it's going to be really funny, you know? Like, I was like, oh, you know, it might just be this goofy little thing. I didn't know that I was going to be looking at an abomination of Christ. I was. I tried uh, to help. And then, like, no, yes, you didn't. I didn't listen. You know what? I'm wrong in that. Yeah, yeah. No, we're here now. So, so no, do your do your thing. You you bought the bush. Go for it, man. Oh. <laughs> I already stopped because that's all I needed to to show you. That's all you need to show me. All right, <laughs> yeah, cool. Like I was like, man, I'm not. Get out the kitchen, I mean, bro. I mean, I could pull get out, out the more kitchen. pictures of people like hanging around their butt, like their waist. <laughs> what the hell? Oh yeah. See, look. Oh, here it what is. What are people? Okay, what are people talking about bullshit. out here? All right. What? No, no, I'm back with bullshit. Ah. <laughs> uh, uh, I saw beautiful. something about wheat harvesting, and I was. Listen, I, I'm. I don't know <laughs> what. What is that? That's that's the strap hook to uh, eliminate egg death. See, look at that. It's a headless base, bro. <laughs> yeah, but, but the thing almost is, almost a bodiless base from that picture. So it, it <laughs> isn't a base from the picture. It is. It is. A, it is a suspended set of pickups with a neck. Look, right. you can even use a wrench. Tension. Just the regular wrench to just drill to your <sighs> my base. Head, my head hurts. <laughs> Okay. See, because look, like, yeah, you have a strap pin right there. That's literally Epiphone territory. So, like, yeah, you want to extend that to, like, right there. And then you're good. No neck dive. <laughs> there you go. Problem solved for an Epiphone base. Just get one of these for 10 bucks on Amazon. Good to go. Let's go to Home Depot. <laughs> just get like a hook that to, you know hang bird feeders. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, just get a two by four and screw it into. The <laughs> put your cut, pull, pull it out to wherever you want. Screw it in. Leave an extra foot or two in case you need to change it later. What two by four will receive from? a screw for a strap button. You're fine. A power get the hell out of here, bro. Tool. <laughs> it's, it's a wrench. Eight dollars. I think wow. this goes under the question of DIY. Yes, exactly. The Y being a capital Y. Uh, With a W With a W. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, so let's let's go ahead and just. I'm starting to get a headache now. Okay, so. Drink some water. Hey, bowling. No, <laughs> no I'm going to the store. I drink water will not be important. purchased. No. Bully, Go away. if you look up the new Thunderbirds we were talking about, they have one that's like all silver in the dark. Oh. No, yeah. don't yeah. say that. Do it. Do you it. got a purple sparkle, no. too. <laughs> Is that what the, so that one's the Zounds exclusive, right? Yeah. Okay. I don't want it. Like, I saw the silver one, and that one made I don't want it. almost. I was like, <laughs> I'm going to need one to experiment with the, like, additional strap no. one, though. So. no. I saw no, they're doing I mean, another Rex Brown signature, but Epiphone, but has a hip shot bridge. Oh, Y'all, see, listen, here's the thing. It's, at some point, I start to question, are y'all my, my people? Like, are y'all my friends? Like, I don't, like, I'm just sitting there, and I'm just like, I'm, I am damaged. I don't like any of this that happened. This, this, none of this is okay. I'm, I thought about playing my drums just to get out of bass discussions. Like, I don't want to. <sighs> He's not one of us. He said he'd play drums. Nah, you... I, I, drummers, drummers rhythm section. He gets a pass. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, 
that's fine. You know. Yeah. Listen, hey, once once I put together drums in the bass house, you can't kick me out of shit no more. <laughs> you can't. I was like, the drummer didn't even put together the drums in the bass house. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> it, it wasn't even it wasn't even him. It was me. Yeah. So yeah, you you don't have car blanche to tell me anything. I'm out here. Dude, that minivan. Dude. Dude. Listen, it did its it did its thing, but I know it's dead now. Right? That thing is not alive anymore. I know it's dead now. It did its thing. It got oh us God. to where we I'm needed so to get to. to. Do a base house. I need to do shit like that. I need to do. I yeah, need to it was like, nah, we we got to run it back again. Like next year, we got to run it back again. Uh, just let me know what I need to pay you. We, yeah, Travis, questionable. The lobster. I'm talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta get. You gotta get further vetted. I don't know. Sono. Sono didn't go. Did you go to the base house? You didn't go no, to the not, base house. Not that year. Floof. I'm, I was still fresh. Yep. <laughs> Floof did not go to the base house. I, okay. I don't even think I was doing YouTube yet, dude. Hell, I don't. The way I'm doing it now. That was last year. Let's see. Uh, it was Amp. Six Amp. Uh, started. You, Omar. Hondo me. came for a bit, right? Did he? I don't know because I got right, we got Hondo. Really Hondo cool. did Hondo? No, Hondo was the year before. They came okay, to the hotel. yeah. And then oh, it was 60 like Cycle guy. that dropped in there. The other guy. Uh, what's his name? Um, oh, it was... Doby. He, he has a fun channel name, too. Um, Doby? Is that um, 60 Cycle Hom guys were there, yeah? Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, you talking about the black dude? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The other black dude? The other black dude. Not, not, not you. <laughs> I know your channel. Yeah. <laughs> the one that wasn't Bully or Honda. <laughs> Hondo Black? Wait, is Hondo Black? <laughs> is Hondo so Black? Like, I, I will, I will be open in discussing and openly say I am not the person to be in this discussion. I am about as white as the sun. So I'm just gonna go ahead and be I'm here a minority and here and nod. Hmm. I gotta talk to Hondo. I don't know that he's. I, I just gave him Mexican. I he could be black. Now that I'm thinking about it. Hold on. I, I'm pretty sure he is. <laughs> I never asked the question. It didn't matter to me. Right? So, okay. Uh, Bahano did show up at the 2020... Apartment? Not the apartment. The uh, hotel. <laughs> 2022? Shit hotel. Yeah, the 2022. Garbage one. hotel. Oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, Wait, what hotel? He pulled up. I don't even remember the name, but it was... So it was bad. Like the it elevator was didn't distance. work half the time, and we were on the ninth floor. Oh, yeah, God. Uh, the uh, it was walking was distance the, from the convention center, though. So it's true. And Roscoe's. Oh. Yeah, oh, I, I, I hit up Roscoe's next year. I, don't I think hit up Roscoe's. Yeah, I was I in there. I, I I would like literally die if I had Roscoe's again. I mean, have it. That's fine. But me. <laughs> I'm in there with that Obama special. Let me go ahead and get right, that real quick. Let's cook. Get away. So let's cook, bully. Uh, we out here, boy. Let me if I pull up. I am not a crook. Uh anyway, so <laughs> Wait, let's see. Roscoe's chicken. So Zach Doobie was there. That's a drummer. We had Dale Bells, Hollywood Dale. We had Omar, we had you, me, Volpini, Amp. I absolutely that's everybody, exactly huh? Exactly where Roscoe's is. That's really funny. That's everybody, right? That's yeah, everybody that was in the house, right? I like the yeah. last comment that just came up that someone Googled it and it says Hondo is Japanese. <laughs> that's Honda. <laughs> no, I think well, Honda is the brand. Oh, Honda Honda brand. brand. Oh, he's looking at the fucking Honda. brand. <laughs> no, Incidentally, uh, didn't they make no that was that was Hunter, uh that made the uh uh the that those weird headless space like Steinberger copies. Oh yeah. Um <laughs> I think I'm just gonna DM court, is it? I think I'm gonna DM Hondo that like according to Base Hang Chat, you're Japanese just for <laughs> context. Can you confirm? 
<laughs> Are you a <laughs> owner of said Hondo Corporation? <laughs> Hondo Automobiles Incorporated. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure he those those engines just don't die, man. You just put oil in them and they keep on ticking. Greatly yeah, as long as you make sure it's got oil in it, doesn't even have to be fresh oil. Honestly, you can mm -mm. get oil from like off the street. You can just you can get oil smooth there. out the ground, not even processed. As long as you have some type of lubrication, pull it, pull that pull cord is gonna run. Uh, what, what car did Honda sell that had a pull cord? Oh man, listen, you play games, but they had a moto compo that you put in a car and that had a pull cord. And that was a two stroke. They have a Honda ATV from 1986 outside and it doesn't even have a pull cord, it has a button. Man, hold on, let me get on this moto compo. Yeah, nobody's doing pull cords anymore except for my snowblower. Tragic. I only used like twice this year. It doesn't have an electric start. It does, but I don't have the pluggy for it, so I I just tough it out. Oh, they came out with a new model. Don't have that down in the basement in one of the drawers of electric electronics. You can't rig that up. Screen. So my my ex my ex's uh, dad gave it to me like seven years ago. <laughs> So I don't I don't want to be like, hey, do you have a cord for the <laughs> moto combo, <laughs> bro? So this this was so if your car got a flat tire, you could go drive to go get somebody to come tow your car. Yeah. But also, it's pretty freaking awesome. This is the this is I the ruckus that. before it's the ruckus, you know? It looks like, like, does the seat and the seat collapse in? That's what it looks yes. like. Yes. Yes, <laughs> it does. It's freaking, freaking sick. $300? Shut up. <laughs> hey, I might make a bad decision, boys. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Wait, wait. That would go crazy. Oh, no. Oh, no, we, we need, we need now? a bully video of him on the Moto Cop. We need, we need the biggest, we need the biggest man. Hey, can let me explain who scooter. I would be. This bro skin oh, no, right here. Exhaust. That's just the exhaust. That's me right there. Can you see me? You can't see me. <laughs> oh, my me. God. I was like, you can actually wait. buy this for that much? No, that's just the exhaust system. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What? What? What is happening? Stop sharing, reshare the Re -share. entire screen. Let me show you who the hell I am. This fella right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Every single time, bro. He has J's on. Hell yeah, dude. Hell oh, yeah, bro. Holy shit. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Oh, that boat. It's three hundred dollars. Oh, dude, I'm gonna go three miles per hour. I'm heavy. Next level. I'm I'm gonna go three miles per hour because I'm heavy, but it's gonna be a glorious three miles per hour. <laughs> That's how bully's gonna get from the base house to to Nam? Well, if it's up in the mountains, I can just pick it up and walk up the hill. But if I'm going down, I'm flying. You're not going through walking, walking up that hill, shit. <laughs> also, I didn't think that through as well. Uh, anyway, uh, I want to take the time to say thank you to everybody that's been on this base hang. I'm gonna go ahead and end it here because I have to make sure everything is set because I'm about to go to sleep. I don't want my wife to be pissed off at me whenever I wake up in the morning. So thank you, special thanks to Leah for dropping in. Thank you so much. Thank you to Travis. Thank you to Floof. Thank you to Sono. Leo, where can they find you at? <laughs> I mean, okay. Well, there's... You know where to find me. Uh, uh, shut Let's up. Who Whatever. I am. Sono <laughs> Jono. Where can they find you at, Sono? They can so find you don't me wanna... on that name. Sono Jono. On YouTube, Instagram, all the other... You just thumb? What's your thumb? That's how you yeah. choose to. Yeah, the I, choose, I choose you. Thumb? No, you don't. I'm out of here. Okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> <Fake>. <laughs>
go. Do it live. Shut up. <laughs> Travis, you haven't got into the game yet, but where could they find you at? Can't find you at all? No. Not really. No. 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 You're not interested? Okay. Completely fine. Floof is a ghost. <clears throat> Where can they find, find you, Floof? Floof dash the bassist <laughs> on YouTube if you want. Uh, if you really want to find me, don't. But, like, you can find me on YouTube. That's always a good way to go about it. Uh, so, yeah, Floof dash the bassist. I just dropped a video today. I usually drop videos every Sunday, and I hope to be seeing y'all real soon. Thank you, Sono. <laughs> also, by the way, I look like this. Oh, he's not right. a ghost. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah, uh, then you just yeah. drop back out again. Okay, cool. Well, <laughs> we're here now. So um, thank y'all for everybody that's on the panel. Appreciate y'all. All y'all over there. Uh, this has been very interesting. It's been very fun. Um, Till next time, I've been Alan Brown, a.k.a. Bully the Kid. Y'all be easy. What the Goodbye, fake, yo. So stupid. Like, <laughs>